talk about this heat now. High temperatures so far today, 87 in Detroit. Same thing in Ann Arbor, 88 in Jackson, 85 in Monroe, 84 in Port Huron. Lots of warmth. It feels hotter than that. These are the current temperatures. You can see the whole lower part of the state here is all toasty, toasty, toasty. 81 is the average high this time of year, but it feels like 91 in Detroit right now. 89 in Troy is the heat index, 91 in Ipsy, 86 in Monroe. Lots of heat and steam, and that will continue into the weekend and into next week, as a matter of fact. So we talked about this yesterday. Much of us just going to watch the day go by and not have a care in the world about any rain. But there is one little spot down here uh, that has popped up and looks like that's going to be working its way down. This is Willis Road. Uh, down to Whitaker, and you can see it's moving southwest here. This is Sumter Township. There's Belleville, so I-94. It's south of that, the southwest corner of Wayne County. That's the only one out there uh, right now, but uh, there might be one more uh, between now and about 8 or 9 o'clock this evening. Very, very few. So this is the concern for the weekend. Here's 930 Saturday evening. This is Henri as a hurricane coming up toward the tip of Long Island, Rhode Island, Connecticut. This is Sunday afternoon. Estimated landfall somewhere around there. That could be a real tough problem for the Northeast. We'll watch that, of course. Lots of uh, friends and family out there, I'm sure. 68 degrees overnight tonight in Detroit. Low to mid 60s in the suburbs. Might be a little fog. Tomorrow, it's hot, sticky. 88 feels like 90, 91, 92, somewhere in there. With sunshine all day, a few clouds. Sunday, there could be a shower. Back to 90 Tuesday and Wednesday, this late summer heat goes on.